Cigars, and he's going to tell you a little bit about a couple of the uh, special cigars that we have here that we haven't had in the store before. Well, we're obviously excited that uh, Tobacco Barn has become uh, the second My Father Cigar Lounge in the country. Uh, one of the things that we're doing for the cigar lounges, uh, it's obviously introduced this cigar right here, which is called the uh, My Father Lounge Exclusive Cigar. It's a phenomenal cigar that uh, is being made by Jaime Garcia. Uh, as an appreciation to all of the lounges. If you ask me what the blend is, I have no idea. He refuses to tell us. What we do know is it's a phenomenal cigar. It's a kind of a in between the my the regular My Father, which is a very noble, medium, medium to full type of cigar, and the uh, My Father Le Bijou, which is more of the uh, as uh, as most of you know, it's a more of an aggressive, full-bodied uh, cigar. Uh, so it's right. Uh, I would consider this more of that three-quarter type of cigar. Phenomenal smoke. Uh, can, again, can only be found at the cigar lounges, so we have a few left here. Not too many. We, we've done great with that. Um, but we're excited. And we got some limiteds left, too. What can you tell me about that? Well, other than the fact that that is by far the hottest selling cigar <laughs> in the country. As you guys can tell, there's only a few left in this box. Uh, this is a cigar that was uh, made by uh, Jaime Garcia, blended by Jaime Garcia this year. The blend changed a little bit from the 2010 to the 2011. Uh, again, we continue to use the Pelo de Oro, which is a hair of gold. That's still in there, two leaves of that in the inside of the cigar, but it's a phenomenal smoke. Again, three-quarter. We didn't want to make it too aggressive so that everybody could smoke it. Uh, but those of you who have tried it, especially the guys online, have been actively speaking about it online. So, it's a again, it's a phenomenal cigar. You just got to try it. So we've had a few changes in the lounge. One of the things I want to point out to you here at the shop is the entire store is a walk-in humidor now. So we're increasing our selection. We've got a third more cigars in here. And we got something uh, kind of neat in the back here. we got a golf simulator you need to give a shot at. I hold the course record, by the way, just so you know. <laughs> So the newest addition to the lounge, we have the uh, top end best golf simulator in the country. It's called HD Golf. They make it up in Canada. This thing is about 99.98% accurate. And uh, now you can come in here and have a foursome and golf one of the top 20 golf uh, ranges or uh, golf, what would I call them? Courses. Courses <laughs> in the country. Enjoy a cigar, watch a game, drink a beer. So I'm going to embarrass myself on camera now. Seven yards. <laughs> no, 76. There we go. I was like, it looked a little further than 27. Now Jose's going to show me how to do it. What happened with Chad is he did not have a cigar, a my father's cigar, in his mouth. All right, it helps so that you can determine the wind speed. <laughs> That's what I use to smoke for. And I write myself, I blame the way of it on it. That damn shirt. I didn't see the ball. Damn shirt. <laughs> now let me show you the addition to the lounge. One of the first things you notice when you walk in now is we got this entire glass wall here, and behind it we've got a now a, a new addition. It's a quieter lounge. So if you want to sit down and just play on your computer, read a book, or play a game of chess, we've got a little place for you to sit. Of course, you'll know right when you walk in the door that my father uh, uh, beautifully hand carved uh, cigar lounge, uh, cigar lounge uh, sign. Sign. <laughs> come on, come on. Here. Uh, obviously, this has not been scripted. Plenty of bloopers for you. And uh, 
Hey, we had a great spread here. We had some great food and beer, and uh, shame on you if you didn't make it to this event. You definitely need to make it to the next one. Come on in. Where are you? <laughs> As you can tell, we've been joined by... Must have been, throughout the course of the day, it's been at least 300 plus people that have come through the doors. Uh, it's been exciting. We've had an opportunity to introduce the cigar to a lot of people that had surprisingly, I, must, I had to ask them, did you live under a rock? They hadn't smoked them. But nonetheless, the beautiful thing has been the feedback that we've gotten. We all love the cigars, especially the uh, lounge exclusive. Uh, I'm very happy with the, my father, the uh, performance of the, my father, the Levy U. The, the Dom Pepin Blue has been a, a great hit. Uh, so overall, we've, we've had a great experience, and as you can tell, there's uh, some of the leftover guys here, but uh, it's still a, a full house. Yep, and I want to thank Jose for all the support, and I look forward to uh, making this one of the best lounges in Southern California. Without, without a doubt, without a doubt. We look forward to it as well.